So today I have here with me a HP laptop, but I encounter a problem whenever I try to boot from a USB device to install a new operating system on it. So I'll be showing you guys what to do if you come across this problem. If you're trying to install an operating system with a USB drive, but you're not able to see it, I'll show you what to do. Okay, so the first thing you do is when you power on the system, you hold down on F9. So this will open up the boot device manager. And uh, if you take a look at the boot device manager we have here, you will notice that the USB device that I have here connected to the laptop is not being displayed in the list. So the next thing you do is you Press on F10 to go to the BIOS setup. Under the BIOS setup, you move to the right to system configuration. Under system configuration, you scroll down to boot options and you hit on the enter key. Under boot options, you come down to legacy support and you hit on enter key. It will give you the option to enable it. You enable it. Right now you will notice before we enabled it, secure boot is enabled, but once you enable legacy support, you will notice that the secure boot becomes disabled. Okay, so once you've done that, you simply hit on F10 to save the changes, you accept. All right, so once you've done that, the system will reboot. When the system reboots, you will notice that it will request that you put in a number and hit on the enter key to complete the change. So I'm going to be doing that. The number actually differs depending on your computer. So I type in the number and I hit on my enter key and I press down on F9 once more. And you will see that in the list of boot options, my USB drive is displayed. Okay, so that's all for this video. If this video helped you in any way, kindly hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video.